Today I'm in Estonia uh, with the North Atlantic Council. Right now I am at the Amari Air Base, which Estonia has upgraded to be available for NATO air policing. I've just seen F-16 fighter jets from the Danish Air Force in action and met American paratroopers. So amid the current crisis in Ukraine, we are stepping up our support to our Baltic allies. I am here today with a simple message. The whole of NATO stands with you. Our commitment to collective defense is rock solid. That is why right now aircraft and ships from across the alliance are reinforcing the security from the Baltic to the Black Sea. Collective defense has always been our central task. And Russia's actions show that we must remain ready to deal with new and unexpected challenges at all times. Russia's actions in Ukraine have been a wake-up call. We all believed that the days in which countries could redraw borders with the barrel of a gun were over. We were wrong. Russia is trying to establish a new sphere of influence, defying international law and agreements with international organizations, including NATO. The Euro-Atlantic security architecture that we built after the end of the Cold War is being challenged. This is a challenge that we must address. We are addressing it now and as we prepare for our Wales summit, we will continue to do what we need to do.